So I want to give you a little insight on my drawing board and my stretching board. It's two in one actually. So I took the normal size, this is a large fox board, and I split it down the middle, as you can see right here. Put it on then, I took a little piece of plastic, very thin piece, it's off a bottle top, and I stapled it onto the top of the board. So what that does then, when I open the board up, it'll keep the fleshing board together, or the drawing board, sorry, together. So at the end of the board, right here, as you can see, I got a 10 inch board screwed on, right here, right, right here, and there's a notch in the board itself, as you can see. So what this is going to do, when I'm finished drawing a little bit, and I'm going to stretch my fur, I will pop the bolt out, like so, and on the other side right here, as you can see, I got three holes put in. So what that's going to do for me, I will open up the board itself, and pop in the, pop in the screw, to where it has to go, like so, and then put on the wing nut. And the wing nut will hold it in place to keep your fur stretched to the size that you need it stretched. So, I figures I'm going to make 10 of these for the year. So, here it is. Now, as you can see now, the board is widened out, and that will make the fox fur. A little bigger. Now you can see why now too, that I have that little plastic shim, plastic piece on top. It'll keep the board together when it opens up. So this will make the fax fur a little bigger. I'll put a little bit more price tag on the head. So it's a very simple design, as you can see. Very easy to make. All right.